All right, it is 12.38. Here's all of our moving stuff. This is literally all we have to take to our car. It doesn't look like a lot, but it is a lot. <laughs> and we're done. We're leaving Florida. It's official. We're all packed. See, it's all gone. We are calling our car the little, uh, our car's name is Heisenbean. So we're calling it the little Heisenbean that could. <laughs> or Heisenbean, the little car that could. Because it's not, not that little, but very nice because we're fitting all our stuff in there. Um, but we were successful. We got it. And now we're leaving Florida. On to North Carolina. We're in Florida forever. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, good. <laughs> We are on our way to North Carolina. So this is our second state that we're hitting if we're counting Utah. So I'm counting Utah. <laughs> um, so we're on the road, um, but we wanted to jump on, what? Yeah, yeah. If I'm counting Utah, North Carolina is gonna be our third. So we're headed to our third state. Um, we're gonna just jump on, do, I wanted to do a little recap as far as what we thought about Florida. Um, for me, I thought that humidity was a lot when I first came here, but then kind of got used to it, really enjoyed it. Really have been an endless summer um, since we got here and it's November and that feels a little weird to me. August, not a fan. <laughs> um, so I think we're both excited to go and experience some autumn and some winter. Um, but I personally have enjoyed the the warm weather all the way through. So I, I really enjoyed that about the the climate of Florida. Not me. Uh, definitely did not like the humidity near the beginning of when we got here, but I kind of got used to it. And then it's apparently we get the cold months of Florida cold. Uh, and the humidity has dropped uh, significantly, which has been nice. But yeah, I'm excited to have an actual fall and a hopefully good winter in North Carolina. Yeah, so besides the climate, I have really enjoyed what we've done here in Florida. Um, I've met a lot of new people, um, were able to see some friends that I only knew online, so I was able to meet those people. We had some of our friends from Utah, some of my siblings come out and do trips with us. Um, we went down to the Keys last week, we've done Disney, we went to the Kennedy Space Center, we have saw like a lot of stuff in nature, been to a bunch of beaches, and um, ran into some random festivals that were happening, which we'll uh, tell you about later. but. Uh, Overall, I really think we've done a, a good job um, at getting out there and seeing things. We didn't do a really good job in August because we kind of got there and we're like, oh, like, we'll have all this time. And then we get into mid-September and we're like, we haven't seen anything. So we made it a real priority to go and see things um, back end of September and October. So we have done lots of stuff. Really felt like I've seen what I wanted to in Florida. Um, and so excited to go and experience North Carolina uh, and be closer to my sister for the holidays so then we can spend time there. And yeah, it's gonna be a really fun time. So Florida, I would say, I don't, I don't, know, if, I don't know if I can compare it to Utah, like if I like Utah better than Florida or vice versa. Um, I, they're just so different, but I have, thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed being here in Florida, so. Bye! We're here at Itchin... <laughs> Tucky. Tuckney. Itchin Tuckney Tuck Park. State Park. Yeah. Um, and it's a natural spring where we ha they have a river that we can tube down. Um, 
you can see the, the people with the tubes behind us, but we already got our tube. It's a double tube. Um, and we're a little bit weirded out because there was not a lot of people here, but that's the funny thing is like when we come to places where there's a ton of people, we're like, uh, but then when there's no people, like very few people we're like, uh, what's going on? So, but we're excited. Nice little break from our road trip today. Um, and excited to get on the water for a little bit. That would be super fun. The tubing experience is not us floating down a river, it's us walking with a tube. With a tube. And me walking carrying a phone because I don't have a tube. <laughs> I have all the power. Do that one more time. Say that it's going to go. Oh, it is? Yeah. You're looking good. You want to swing your hips a little bit? Mm, get it. So we are currently in Columbia, South Carolina, and we decided to spend a little bit more money tonight and stay in this cute little Airbnb. Known so, as a hanger home. Known as a hanger home. So August, you want to give us the official tour? Official tour includes some acorns. Oh yeah, well first of all, there's this massive acorn tree here which leads to so many acorns all over the ground and they're falling and hitting me on the head. This is the porch, two chairs to come and relax and watch acorns fall because there's not a ton of activity going on. Oh, we can't see the code. Here's the yeah, couch, area. the TV, cool. I'm gonna put my water bottle down. Then we have this little dedicated workspace, very, very small. Yeah, I was gonna say, this is a really good sized kitchen. We've got stove, microwave, a little pantry there. What's, is this like a little patio? This is the laundry unit. Oh. Yeah. Just open that. Look at that. My inside. the main hallway, <laughs> you have the bathroom. Very nice, very nice. It's got this like red paint. And then this is like, like tiny little guest room, single twin bed. Nice little room. There's a desk, nothing spacious. Anyway. And then here's our room. This is where the magic happens. Okay. This is just a really nice big bed compared to our bed last night. Cool. Just get into the closet. <laughs> just kidding. So fun. I'm super excited to stay here for the night. It's so cute and it's all our own little space. So. 
Now I gotta go explore some some South Carolina. Little Colombia. <laughs> Alright ladies and gentlemen, we are back at it. You see our car? All the stuff. <laughs> Built to the brim. Is we are headed from Florida here. Wow, this road is bumpy. To North Carolina. So, uh, this drive is definitely not as long as the one from Utah to Florida, which I think we're both very grateful for. <laughs> um, it just is easier overall that we don't have to drive six states across the country. Um, but we're headed, we're gonna make a couple of stops because how I planned the trip was I booked the Airbnb in North Carolina on a Sunday and then we had to check out of our Airbnb in Florida on a Friday. The reason I did that was because I thought it was gonna take 10 hours, it was a long, a long time to drive, but then we realized that it wasn't actually that long of, to drive. Um, so we've just been now exploring and jumping around. We stayed in Savannah, Georgia the first night, which actually has a lot of like haunted lore, uh, which is really cool got to see a cemetery and everything like that and then we stayed in Columbia South Carolina last night super cute Airbnb which I'll show you guys um, we got a video on that as well so now we are uh, it's Sunday and we're headed up to our Airbnb in North Carolina yay and we have just like catapulted right into autumn slash winter so that's exciting. I bet you're pretty excited because it's <laughs> getting I'm colder. <laughs> we're finally out of the loop of summer. I'm a little sad, but we're excited. So it's still 72 degrees. Outside. It is still 72 degrees though. Yeah, yeah. So not that cold. Um, but we're excited for a new place. <laughs> One eternity later. <laughs> okay. So, we've been here for about a week, but this is our North Carolina Airbnb. <laughs> I'm coming. I'm coming, I'm coming. Thank you. All right. All right, give us a tour. I do like how spacious it is. See how we can fit all of our board games right there. You want to do a little display? <laughs> August, you want to explain to us why you're wearing a blanket? <laughs> We, we uh, switched from being in Florida weather, which is 98, not 98, 89 90. degrees to 50. <laughs> We've got this nice fireplace here, which I like that. It, it does not turn on though. Um, so we got super spacious living room, which I love that. Yep, give a demo of the couch, beautiful. Okay, so now I'm not loving the the window here that doesn't have any blinds. Makes it so then having the lights on at night, not great, but the, the good thing is that our neighbors are trees, so there's nobody right. looking in. It's like the people like way past the tree. But anyway, uh, here we have like a little, thing here. A little porch swing, which, very cool. Here we've got beautiful trees. No, don't close the door on me. <laughs> it's cold out here. So our background, our backyard is literally the forest, which love that. Now my socks are getting wet. <laughs> so there you go. There's the living room. 
Here is the kitchen and dining room. Oh, wrong way. We got this awesome table. You see you got August set up here with the PC. So we're making it work wherever we go because there was only one desk. So August made it, it work and set it up so it looks awesome on the table. Here's the hallway. The reason we have all this stuff out is because our kitchen sink has a leak, so we're getting that fixed. Um, and then the guy, the owner of the Airbnb brought us by an air fryer, which we've absolutely loved the air fryer. It's been amazing. Another thing is that the fridge creates ice now, which I'm very excited. Um, so that's the kitchen area. And we have the way over here, we have the laundry room. Max also has a nice little sauna. Yeah. Heater so the funny thing is that the heater, there's a, like the main vent is right up there. And so it warms Turn this room. This yeah, it warms this room up so quickly. And so we treat it like our little sauna. And here's the guest room slash Elena's little office. Another mural. We also have this bed in case anybody wants to visit us, which it's gonna be the holidays. So we're gonna have some people visit us. We've got our robot baby from Disney. Got nice new computer. It's our robot baby. <laughs> then we have my little setup, so my PC. I do my work there. I love it. It's so nice having a desk. So that's that room. Here we have the guest bathroom. Nothing to note there, just it's a bathroom. The bathrooms are a lot smaller. Then, yeah, in Florida. Uh, and here's the master bed. We get a big bed. Yeah, it's a very big bed. Uh, very big for us. We, uh, I, I kind of don't like it. It's a little too big. <laughs> it's a, that's a lot. There's a lot of, lot of room. And then we have our bathroom, which is not too, not too special. No crazy sinks. Yeah, it's just another bathroom. <clears throat> and then here's where we're storing all of our stuff. Because this is a really big closet. So we were able to store everything in here. And then here, here. Show the people your favorite thing about this entire Airbnb. Oh, yeah, okay. My, fa my favorite thing is that the laundry basket, you're like, oh, it's just a normal laundry basket. Wrong. It rolls so that I can take it to the laundry room without having to carry it. <laughs> it's my favorite thing. <laughs> I love that. Along with the air fryer, very nice. Um, along with... Um, along with the nice bed, the water gets super warm in the shower, so I love that, the ice maker. Overall, love it, and we really do like North Carolina. So, there's our place for three months, and then we're going to Tennessee.